Simpkins, another player in this year's draft pool that has a few question marks on him because of that injury and his inability to get back and play this year. Obviously, he suffered the broken leg at the start of the season. And before that, I think he was touted as a possible top 10 pick. Broke my leg in round three of this season. Straight away, I was pretty, was pretty down. Um, felt pretty, pretty upset about the whole situation, obviously not knowing what's going to happen for the future. Um, yes, had surgery three days after, I think it was. So I got a plate and six screws put in my leg. It's been a pretty tough year. Yeah, been out the whole season, so just been trying to do me rehab and get myself right back and as quick as possible. Pretty frustrating. A bit angry about it. Yeah, I guess um, you wanted to show what you can do to all the clubs and all the recruiters this year, so not being able to do that, obviously, um, yeah, it's really frustrating. Obviously not playing this year, you don't really know what clubs think of you or some clubs might think highly, some might think low, so, yeah, you never really know what might happen. A fumble, a give, Hogan, left boot, now to Oliver, Oliver, goal! Clayton's been a good mate of mine now for a long time. He sort of moved over to Marupna in under 14s, I think. Started living at my house probably most weekends just so he could play footy. And then he ended up getting his own little apartment in Marupna. And, yeah, no, we've, we get along really well and been good mates for a long time. Mum's Aboriginal, um, so her family's all lived in Marupna, Saunders family, um, yeah, from the Yorta Yorta tribe. How much does it mean to you? Yeah, a lot. Obviously a lot. Going through all the footy pathways of how much they've helped me out um, with the flying boomerangs and stuff like that. It's been, yeah, it's been great. Make the Pies supporters feel a bit better about themselves after last week. Simpkin did well. Just stabs the ball to his teammate. Uh, I think I'm going to bring a bit of X factor, um, a bit of flare up, dangerous around the forward line. Definitely my endurance, my agility, uh, my footy IQ is pretty well. I get to the right positions and pretty dangerous in the forward line. He's a good mark overhead for his size. He's got really good endurance. Although he is a small player, he still has to work on his midfield craft, but he's exciting. We saw that last year as a bottom major where he kicked the match winner after the siren against Vic Metro in a game down at Simmons Stadium. Just a steady hand around goal. Reads the ball off the packs really well and is smart. So just a player that you can see slotting in at the feet of a big forward at the AFL level. Popping up is Jacob Ellison. He's got a teammate free. And there are men everywhere at the moment. And a short kick came from Simpkin. My favourite footy memory is probably um, kicking the goal after the siren last year in the Vic Country match against Vic Metro in round one. Hopefully develop into a steel side bottom just with his smarts and endurance around the field. Try and idle my game on him so over the next few years try and develop and just play like him. Hopefully by the end of this month I should be nearly right back into the full swing of things, so by day one of the pre-season I should be right to go.